A rising film evaporator involves long vertical tubes, typically 5 to 15 meters long and uh, 2.5 to 5 centimeters in diameter. These tubes are placed inside the steam chest where the liquid inside the tubes is heated from the outside by condensing steam as we see in this animation. As the liquid at the bottom of the tube heats, bubbles will form that rise inside the tube at high velocity. So typically we have slugs of liquid and bubbles rising rapidly to the top of the tubes. The velocity can be very high, up to 100 meters per second. The liquid and bubbles then exit at the top and often upon exit they hit baffles to break up any foam. This type of evaporator is used mostly as once through. That means you allow the product to go through the tubes only once, although sometime recirculation is also used. One gets very high heat transfer coefficients in this type of system. A rising film evaporator is used in the manufacture of condensed milk.